B. Yes, sir. How you doing, my brother? I'm doing great. Glad to All be right. here. Um, this is our first um, first episode of Hangar Five Radio Baycast Show. How you doing, man? Good. Had a good day today. Yeah, you t- uh, took the girls out earlier today, you said? Woke up early. Got some, <laughs> I mean, got you wake up early all the time. I mean, <laughs> you need that in your life. Okay. Uh, you know, the things that we're going to talk about today is what is Hangar 5? Hangar, to me, I, I always grew up with this um, with this thing of wanting to own like a, like a aircraft mm. a hangar. Got you. Right? Almost there, but show us Hangar 5. It's just a more aspirational thing. Mathematics. And you know what? Hopefully one of these days we will be in a hangar doing the show. We're going to be breaking down uh, a lot of what we have going on at CSB, right? We're right. going to be reporting on it, commentating on it. Um, highlighting and players. Highlighting players. Highlighting teams. Yes. And we're going to be doing more post-game pre-game interviews and all that fun stuff um giving so that it more, giving it more life giving more light exactly and um what we're also going to do is we're going to go ahead and uh try uh try to do not try we will do a csb magazine it's going to be not a full big old magazine it's going to be what photographers use um to catalog their work and it's like a, it's going to be like a Reader's Digest, right? Like a handout pamphlet. Yeah, almost. yeah. It's going to be looking like a pamphlet, but it's going to be really high quality. It's going to be like a magazine, but a small magazine first, just to see how that goes, right? Mm-hmm. It's going to showcase, obviously, a lot of what's going on in our program at CSB on a month basis. So I want to give people more bang for their buck. And I don't really care about... Co- it's not a competition between us and other organizations. It's trying to provide a different experience for our community. What do you think about that? I think it's beautiful. I think a lot of people, including myself, turn to this something like this. And as you know, I bring my family every weekend. Yes. They're involved. They ask me when's your weekend. They participate when's your, when's your in playing ball, and, specifically Taylor. And uh, I developed a lot of good relationships with uh, since I've been playing in this organization. Right. And I think um, that itself is important to me. Right. And I don't think I'm much different than the next man or the next woman. And I think right. It's some so for some people, including myself. This is a part of my lifestyle. Mm-hmm. We'll also be covering the Asian All American magazine stuff, uh, which the right. stuff will be reporting on um, the current players that we highlighted, mm-hmm. in, or we highlighted, or will highlight in the magazine, right? And um, we'll be following them through their high school season and college season, and hopefully we'll have the pleasure to be at the game and we'll do a play by play. Yeah, I think that's that'd be awesome, man. Especially for the parents, they want to see their. Kids showcased and they want to see a light in their future. Right, and and you know I I think I think it's not even like uh, trying to get um, a spotlight for uh, like a uh, a recruiter or anything. It's just the experience, man. Right. I think all experiences. It's the journey of it's it. It's the journey of it, man. All we are doing, we're just a vessel of their journey. Yes, and making it more of an experience they can remember forever and share with their family that may live in. Canada or New York, and they could they can send them this information and be like, oh, I'm so glad Jessica's doing so well. I saw her video or picture in the magazine. Right. We will be uh, discussing a lot of the upcoming talents, the current talents that we have on the books that have already gone through the Asian American magazine experience, and um, yeah, we will be highlighting a lot of those um, that part of the community or reporting. A lot of those things that have to go on with the magazine and and then Super also good. yeah and then also we'll just be just doing a regular a regular commentating on just a on the radio show of just current news pop culture sports music entertainment fashion lifestyle health and wellness and all that good stuff. Can Ooh. I send a quick warning out? Yes, <laughs> that we will be. There's a lot of comedy that's going to be happening on this show. Just right. I know it's right, right now. Right, 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 right. We're Which, just being flat out right now. Right, right. There, there's going to be a lot of comedy going on. Yeah, and just yeah. be prepared. There's a lot of jokes, and yeah. please don't be offended by anything. You know, we just try to put more light and color right. into the situation. And for those who know us, knows what to expect, and hopefully. They'll share us with their family and friends. I hope and so. Maybe we will be an acquired be. taste. But look it, we're just putting it out there because I think this will be a great platform. We're highlighting people, normal people in our community. And let's just get that straight. Like, uh, there's um, 
there's a lot of news out there, but they're not covering the people that we care about, the community that we care about. And it's not about fame and fortune with us. We just want a platform to discuss what is important to us in our lives, what's, what we feel is important for our community. Right. And all that. It's right. just a way to kind of step away from social media, not in the sense of letting it go, but just to put more focus on our community and our family and put your phone down every now and then. Right. And just get to know who this guy is over here. See who that woman is over there and be familiar with them so you can go up to him and say hello and, right, not, right. and, and have something to, in common to share. Right. And, you know, this radio show will open up doors for hopefully, you know, a, a lot of our youth or even young right. adults or people our age in our 40s, you know, and mm -hmm. uh, we just want to create a movement, not just a movement in like well, this radio show going somewhere, but a movement in you, like right. uh, creating a, a change in you. Be interested in participating in this radio show because, you know what, if if you participate in any of the CSB um, programs or if you are a participant in the Asian American magazine, you're going to be interviewed. You're going to be – we're going to make you a part of the show. We're, we're normal people, man. Look, we have high-stress jobs, and really this is an – like, you know, again, I was just telling Brandon that this might be a great way for me to work out my mental <laughs> uh, – you know, my mental health issues, mm -hmm. man, because uh, for those who participate in the CSB, I, I, I put it out there because I want everyone to know that it's OK to talk about it, man. You know, and um, obviously it's great for people to support me and all that stuff. But um, I just uh, as a man and I think a lot in the Asian community, we don't really talk about mental health. That's a that's a general man. That's a general thing. man. What's thing, wrong with man. you? Nothing. All right. What are you gonna right. do about that situation? I got it. Right. That's it. Right. And <laughs> I, I think you know we're 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 I think I would say that we're um, we bring a lot of complexity in this uh, in this duo host here on this panel right now. Uh, so there will be a lot of lessons learned, male and female, because we're gonna talk about everything. Yeah. Okay. Definitely. We're going to try to be the best uncles out there for a lot of these youths. And I think that's what's missing out there right now is to have an uncle to help clear things up, maybe steer things up, or maybe or confuse you. Or straighten things or out for you. Straighten stuff, straighten stuff, straighten stuff, stuff out for you. Out for you or confuse here. you more so oh, you can yeah. do more research. I came in with, came in with one right. question. <laughs> right. I got ten and questions. I got ten <laughs> questions. But I think that's what's, uh, that's what's missing right now in our community. We're, we're, we're missing grandmothers and grandfathers because they're Absolutely. in their 40s, in Absolutely. their 30s. 30s. Yeah, 30 <laughs> they're too old young. grandmas. Yeah, the club. <laughs> the club. Grandma. The and club. grandpas too. What I'm saying is I think we all need um, a big brother an uncle an auntie to yeah, help us out through some tough times I think that's what's missing and the thing is today we're too busy man we're too busy and that's what's and I think when we don't find the time to recognize oh Joey looks like he needs um if there's I, something wrong with Joey. Let's I talk think, to Joey. Yeah, I, I, I need. I think I need to talk to. I think that's what we're not doing enough of. Well, man. Google does it for us now. Google is, is Google's Uncle, Uncle Google. Uh, Uncle Google. I'm putting ourselves in a position to be heard through. Yes. The, through the problem. Through the problem. You know what I'm saying? We right. have to fight fire with fire. We got sometimes we got to fight Either fire that with or fire. We can, uh, we can take the problem <laughs> and uh, what's the word? Metamorphosize it. Yeah, we can change, change it. Change it into yeah. what it is, into something right. greater. Exactly. Or you would just spark up the uh, the conversation about it. Anyways, but that's what we're going to be doing, guys, with as far as uh, trying to open up the eyes and ears in different communities in our, within our community. And for those parents and that's been reaching out to us about uh, the Asian American magazine, uh, the reason why we have not posted any new content, guys, is to be completely 100 percent honest, uh, we actually had an investor come in um, and uh, and he needed content to be issued out in a certain way. In a certain time, and it was it was really hard for me to work for somebody in that sense when someone's invested a lot of money in the magazine. And so, to the parents out there, I apologize that we did not get back to you in a timely manner. There's a time frame where uh, I had to 
we rectified the problem. We no longer have that primary investor anymore. So there were some financial things that had to be worked out. And uh, I think November 5th is when we can move forward with putting out content. And I want to apologize to those those other organizations and other magazines that was reaching out to us and we, we have not gotten back to you yet, but if you're listening to this, hopefully you're listening toward the end of this this radio show. We apologize we will get back to you and we will make something happen. This radio show is just not going to be hosted by these two uh, handsome gentlemen. We're going to have we're going to have a panel of of other hosts that come in different ages, different backgrounds, different uncles, different aunties. Different Uncles, low lows and low yeah, and and if they're young enough, they could be your cousins and your sisters, mm-hmm. or brothers. But we we want to diversify the panel, which is really important. We will be touching up on uh, different types of uh, topics and subjects, and that we're not familiar with, but we're interested in. Mm-hmm. So we're gonna try to bring in as many of those people as possible to support you and to inform you and to hopefully, uh, you know once again raise some kind of consciousness and and change the way you think about or give you a different perspective give maybe something not to think change about. yeah something to think about give but give you a about. different perspective all right guys we really appreciate uh your time to listen through this towards the end of this radio show episode one brandon yes i appreciate you my dude you have some closing thoughts just want to encourage everyone to listen try to uh tune in as much as possible um we would appreciate your support so that way we can continue doing this uh it's something that we want to do for everybody we want everyone to be all inclusive and hopefully it will uh affect your lives and make your lives better and yeah uh, better not worse but if it's worse we apologize yeah well he <laughs> apologizes it's his idea it's all his idea his I had nothing idea. to do with it okay guys we really appreciate your time thank you very much for listening to the first podcast show or radio show I'm sorry um, have a good night thank you B thank you